Hi. Let me show you some code mixing generators and promises. Here we want to compute the value of a portfolio of stocks with action from Microsoft, Apple, Amazon, Facebook and Google. The code starts with an URL provided by Google to access stock quotes and uh, this code is followed by the http.getasync function which is a promisified version of http get. The helper function exhaust is common to all mixes of generators and promises. The exhaust function takes a generator, it turns it into an iterator and it iterates this iterator until the end. The generator should yield promises and exhaust attached sequels to these promises in order to resume the iteration. The real specific code is the portfolio generator. It reads a, a wallet, a JSON file, and for every name in the wallet, it fetches its price, that is, it yields a promise to fetch the page from which is extracted the price. And then we update the total value of the portfolio. The exos portfolio expression returns a promise to which we attach SQLs, then and catch to see the result. I have added traces throughout these functions to let you observe the ping pong between getasync, exhaust and portfolio. You can even use your favorite debugger to step in the code of a generator. However, the price to pay with this version of these functions is that everything is done sequentially. Stock prices could be fetched with more concurrency. This is not important with a small portfolio, but it will become a real burden if the portfolio contains thousands of stock.